Hello everyone, this is just a quick update about my uh, future Fallout 4 content, um, that being the new Let's Play and the new build videos in Fallout 4. Um, I said in my last channel update that I would be starting the new Let's Play near the middle or end of May, and well, <laughs> obviously May has come and gone and there hasn't been any Fallout 4 content yet, so this update is just to tell you why and to give you an update on my plans. Um, so Fallout 4 content is still coming, so don't worry. It's just going to be delayed a little bit longer, um, probably another month at least. And the reason for that is because I'm actually getting a new PC. And the reason I'm getting a new PC is because my old one just isn't up to snuff to play Fallout 4 with mods. Um, I was getting exceptionally bad frame rate. I mean, you guys would probably need barf bags handy if you watched me play with that frame rate. Trust me. Now, you may be wondering, you know, how could I play Skyrim with mods and not experience bad frame rate like that? And the answer is, I have actually, I got Skyrim installed on an SSD. So it runs a lot faster than where I have Fallout 4 installed. Uh, but there isn't enough room on that same drive for Fallout 4. That's why I don't have it on there. And my computer has only one SSD. So it's not big enough for both of the games um, with the mods too. And so, but also I'm pushing my graphics card to the max and I'm still not getting the performance that I want out of it. Um, so... I discussed the issue with a couple of my patrons who are computer savvy. They're pretty smart about this stuff, way more than I am. And uh, they came to the conclusion that while I could just upgrade my PC, I could get another SSD, I could get a new graphics card, and then it would probably work for me just fine. Um, but it would be a temporary fix since the machine is already a few years old. Um, so they said that the money would be better spent just getting a brand new PC so that it would last me, you know, a long, longer time and I could rely on it better. Um, so these guys, let me tell you, they are the best. Honestly, they got together and designed for me a brand new machine to the specifications I needed to do exactly what I needed it to do. And then one of them, who is actually the same guy who gave me my current machine a couple years ago, he bought all the parts, built the new machine from scratch, and had it shipped to me as a gift. And I'm just blown away. I, seriously, I cannot rightly express my gratitude, really. I'm... Uh, oh, yeah. I think I cried. <laughs> Honestly. Um, anyway, so I basically put all of the PC-related channel stuff on hold until I can get it transferred over to the new machine. So that's why the delay has been, has happened. Um, so the machine just arrived last week, actually. However, I am getting ready for a week of vacation starting on the 11th, and I have been super busy because of that. Um, so I haven't had a chance to even touch the new PC yet. It's just been sitting on my floor gathering dust. I hate to say that, but it's true. I haven't even turned it on. Anyways, um, it actually has some parts that I need to install and stuff before I can actually turn it on. But anyway, um, so I haven't, yeah, I haven't had a chance to look at it and I probably won't until I get back. In fact, I'm not even going to try until I get back because I just, I can't have that extra thing on my plate right now. And so, but then once I'm back, you know, I have to get it set up. I got to get, you know, the parts installed and I got to get it working properly with my recording equipment. I need to install my game, my mod manager and all my mods. And you know, I'm not sure how long that will take. Um, but once that's done, I will be spending every spare moment finalizing my load order and getting ready to start the new Let's Play. So now I'm hoping... Um, to get the Let's Play going by at least the middle of next month, if all goes well. I mean, I'm, I'm trying to give myself a month to work on this. I, I, I honestly cannot tell you if it will take that long or if it will take longer, but that's my guesstimation. Um, but once it's going, once the Let's Play is going, 
then there will be Fallout 4 content on my channel again for the foreseeable future, like a long time. I mean, my first Fallout 4 Let's Play lasted for almost three years, if you include the breaks between the chapters, and I'm sure I won't have trouble making the new one last that long too, if people like it enough. So I think I'll be covered for a while, and of course I will be having build videos along with the Let's Play as well. So. But for those of you who have been enjoying my Fallout 76 content, don't worry, it's not going anywhere. I'm not replacing it with Fallout 4. I will be doing both games side by side, both Let's Plays and build videos. But the Fallout 76 Let's Play is going to start having guests in it, finally. Yeah, you guys have been wanting me to get guests for a while. And it's it, the, the logistics are crazy, let me tell you. Um, and so... We've pretty much been trying to work out the logistics all this time, and we finally got them figured out, at least mostly. Um, I actually did a casting call with my patrons. I'm, I'm, they get the first, you know, because they're patrons, they get the first chance to be in my Let's Play. And if I am not able to fill all of the roles with my patrons, then I will draw from my general um, subscriber base, so who knows, you guys may have a chance, at least a few of you, obviously not all of you can, but a few of you might have a chance to be in my Let's Plays, um, in my Fault 76 Let's Play in the future, but I will, um, I will be doing a casting call if that time comes, if my patrons aren't able to, to fill the roles that I need. Um, so just keep an eye out, so I don't know for sure if it's going to happen or when it will be just, you know, keep an eye out. I'll, I'll make an announcement video if, if it happens. Anyways, um, so we just recorded the first episode um, with a guest. <laughs> Actually, today, as I record this, we just recorded it. However, you guys won't get to see that episode until a few weeks from now because we actually do record them pretty far in advance. But, you know, something to look forward to. Anyway, that's really all I wanted to say to just let you know that I haven't forgotten about the Fallout 4 content. I've just been busy optimizing my equipment to handle it. <laughs> that's about it. And I'll be sure to keep you guys updated as I get closer to being ready. Like I said in my channel update, I'll likely make a video or two where I show off my mod load order and feature some of the mods I'll be using once I get that figured out. So keep an eye out for that. And I'll also be posting my progress on my social media, especially on my Discord server. So if you'd like to keep up on that, then do go join me there. All the links are down in the description. Oh, and one more thing. Um, there will not be a build video this weekend. Um, I tried really hard to get one done, but I have just been so busy. I haven't had the time to make one. And really, I haven't had the inspiration to make one, to be honest, because I've just been so frazzled. Um, but... Um, and I will also be gone all next week on my trip, so there probably won't be one next weekend either, unless I get some amazing inspiration before I leave. But, um, I will have Red Dead and Fault 76 Let's Plays posted, um, on time the week that I'm gone. So, you'll at least, you know, there'll be some content there for you. Anyway. Oh, also, um... I'll likely not have much access to the internet or even a cell signal a lot of the time while I'm gone because we're camping in the mountains. So I may be absent from my social media as well. So just, you know, don't worry. I'm, I'm not dead, probably. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, that's all for this video. I will see you next week after I'm back. And until then, remember to play safe, play nice, and have fun. Bye, guys.